We're gonna put Luka on every team to see him win MVP 30 times. Let's start out in Philly. Well, his own teammate won it, so that's over one. And his other teammate won sixth man of the year. At least he made first team, though. Sixers made the one seed. I mean, he put up good numbers, but I don't think he got robbed. Why are the Bucks in poverty? And that's gonna go ahead and be a gentleman sweep. I did not notice the Miles Bridges signing. And that'll be another gentleman sweep. Look at that. The Nets in the conference finals is crazy. And well, that's gonna be a sweep. And now we have the most common NBA finals based off 2K stats, Grizzly Sixers. And Luka gets his first ring. Would have been a choke job if he didn't. Like, this team is definitely stacked. I don't know how you would lose. He didn't even win finals MVP on the next team. Now he's gonna play with Giannis. Might be tough to win MVP here. Wow, 0 for 2. I'm shocked. He'll be the first or second seed on pretty much any team he goes to. If they got the first seed, he probably would have won it with these numbers, but it is what it is. Now we gotta play Boston. And that's gonna be a nice sweep because having Giannis and Luka on one team is overpowered. Can Miami make this semi competitive? Probably not. And it looks like I was right on that one. Now we have the Cavs who 2K likes, so maybe they'll take a few games. We got game seven tied with a minute left. Luka with the ball in the corner on Kevin Love. He gets double team, kicks out the Porters for three. Misses it. Rebound by the Cavs. Mitchell with six seconds left. Drew Holiday guard him. There's no way he's going to score on Drew Holiday. Three seconds left. Okay, they're just not really doing anything. Mitchell with the pull at mid-range. Makes it with one second left. And the Bucks took Giannis out of the game. Don't know the strategy. They give it to Luka. Luka going to pull up the heave. And he misses it. Cavs moving on. Well, so far, Luka can't win on MVP and can't win with Giannis. We're in Chicago with Luka at number four overall draft pick, Patrick Williams. Oh, for three, Luka. What are you doing? I guess first team's cool. And they were the first seed. He wasn't even the leading scorer. DeRozan was. Wow, yeah, you didn't deserve it. We got to take down Giannis. Gonna get that done in a blowout in six games. Now we got Ben Simmons in the Nets. Well, they're Ben's team for a reason. That'll be a gentleman sweep. Let's see if we can take down this gritty Cavs team. We're somehow in a game seven again. Luka, can you finally be clutch in one of these games? Luka, size now. Give us Alonzo for three. You got to make that, Lonzo. Oh, my God. Mitchell for three. Makes it. Oh, dude, why is Donovan Mitchell so clutch? They took Luka out of the game. Lonzo gives the screen here. Lonzo trying to drive on Jared Allen. Kicks out to Vucevic. Vucevic for three. Misses it. Rebound, Allen. The Rosen for three. And it's off, and that'll be game. Is there, like, secret sauce in Dallas or something? You can't win anywhere else. Based off our knowledge before, this should be an instant championship. Hey, there you go. Finally got one. Those are some ass numbers, though. Wow, that's bad. I mean, for his standards, I'm not dropping a point in the NBA. Maybe I hit a three if someone leaves me open. You never know. We got seven seconds left, tie game. Luka with the ball. Gonna step back from three. Pump fake. He's got Trey Young on him. Just pulled the shot. Mix it! And the Cleveland Cavaliers are moving on to the second round. Unless Trey Young has something to say. Well, he's not even at the three-point line. <laughs> That was so bad. Now we got to play the Sixers. And 2K will never make sense. How does this Cavs team just whoop us without Luka? Then we get Luka and we lose in the second round. I don't know if he'll win MVP on this team because this team is really good, but we'll find out. And B just keeps winning it. And to no surprise, Boston got the first seed. There's just too many good players on this team for Luka to win MVP, so it makes sense. Every series should just be a sweep no matter what. Well, I guess gentlemen sweeps somewhat count. We'll take it. Now we got to play Miami. Another gentleman sweep in store for us. And now we have the real MVP, Joel Embiid. And we're going to lose in six to Philly. This is crazy. Luka is straight up a loser if he can't play in Dallas. We should put Kawhi on a minute restriction to make this more realistic. This man is taking Luka's job. At least they got the one seed. He still put up good numbers, just can't drop enough points because Kawhi and Paul George. We got Portland in the first round, and that's going to be a sweep. Haven't seen that in a long time. Now we got a gritty Minnesota team who has marketing now. Don't know why this went six games, but okay. We're going to lose to the Pelicans. Just watch. I literally called it. Look, gentleman sweep. There it is. There it is. Gentleman sweep. I literally called it. Let's see if he can get an MVP or ring with Ja. Can someone else win MVP? Got the one seed. And if you're not going to be the leading scorer, you're not going to have a chance. They almost lost in the first round to the Trailblazers. Now we got a tough Clippers team, and we just beat them in six. Ja dropped 40 in this game. Luka, what are you doing? And here's where the journey ends. Or wait, are you telling me Luka and Ja can make it to the finals? Wow. And now we have the Hawks in the finals. And that's going to go ahead and be a sweep. The Grizzlies winning the championship. Ja finals MVP. So after joining seven different teams, you've won two championships and one MVP. We got two MVPs on the board. Trey Young got six, man. Congrats. We got Toronto in the first round as the one seed and that'll go ahead and be a sweep now we got philly who decided to sign bridges again why do they keep doing that we're gonna blow them out in seven games as in game seven you know what i meant gotta take down simmons and trey young and luka donich are going to the finals i don't know why i said trey's name first Wait, we gotta play josh just gotta hold on here and they're champions luka going to work here trying to josh a kick at the trey young wide open for three makes it five point game how will john Morant respond gonna drive and throw it down oh my god john Morant gonna pull the fadeaway three why would he shoot that Dejounte running in the fast break on 
on Ja gonna bring it back and slow. No, he's gonna try to get the basket on him, and he does. Five point game. Ja gonna drop to the basket, pull up midi. That's off rebound, Hawks, and that's gonna do it. Well, this was easily Luca's best season so far. I got the MVP and the championship. Let's keep going. Let's see how he culture treats Luca. Should we start counting in beads MVPs? Why is Luca on the Heat a third seed? Of course, the team that I'm a fan of is the worst one so far. Gonna be fun watching Caleb Martin guard Giannis, and we're just gonna get by in seven games. This might be Luca's best playoff game since I've hit record. I can't, or at least in a game seven. Maybe that Trey Young game winner, that one could be it too. And we're just barely gonna lose to the Sixers in seven. Okay, well, there's nothing we can do about that. Bro dropped 46, 16, and five. This is the first bad team we've been on. Let's see what happens. I did not expect this when I decided to record this. Don't worry, Luca has yet to not make the first team. I'll let you know when he doesn't. They're in the play-in tournament, which kind of makes sense. Well, they lost the first game, and I accidentally sim past it, but we're in the playoffs playing Philly. I mean, that's not a bad year, but you're not gonna win it being the eighth seed. But I guess if anyone could, it would be Luca, and they're gonna be out in a gentleman's sweep. And this will probably be the worst team on paper that we joined, so let's see what Luca can do. This man in beat is taking advantage of this opportunity, and the Jazz aren't even in the playoffs. Might have to do this video again just with Embiid. Now we're on another bad team, the Kings. I think he has a good shot to win it, though. Jesus, he just keeps winning it. Okay, I think Luca making the Kings a one seed deserves MVP. But these stats suck, Luca. Come on, man. We got the Clippers in the first, and Luca and the Kings are just gonna get by here in seven. And now we have to play this terrible Lakers team. And of course, this terrible Lakers team takes us down in seven. Westbrook hit two threes. Yeah, this sim ain't real. Now we got Luca in the garden. Let's see what happens. Luca, this is sad. He is making franchises relevant and getting no credit. This man started splitting shots with Julius Randle, and he can't win an MVP ever again. And we're gonna gentlemen sweep Miami in the first round. Now we got this tough Cleveland team. Yeah, well, a little too tough. That's gonna be a sweep on us. Now we got Luca with LeBron and AD. It's gonna be tough to win MVP. I think Embiid just wants to be a meme at this point. And for the first time, Luca didn't make first team. He's on the second. And the Lakers are the second seed. I guess this isn't that surprising, but damn. They're gonna gentlemen sweep Damon the Blazers. Now we got Booker and the Suns. And that's gonna go ahead and be a sweep. I think we've only beat New Orleans one time this whole video. And now it's gonna be two times. Look at that. In the finals. Against the Bulls with number four overall draft pick Patrick Williams. I don't know if I should be excited here. It's Luca, LeBron, and AD like you should win the championship. So congrats, I guess. All right, well, this is poverty. Let's see what happens. What's that, like 10 MVPs for Embiid? Does making the third seed as the Magic not deserve MVP? And these are pretty good numbers. How does this not warrant MVP? We're gonna barely get by the Heat here in seven. Now we got the seven seed Cavs. And we're just gonna gentlemen sweep this team, okay? And now we have Patrick Williams and the Bulls. Like, I think taking the Magic to the NBA Finals warrants MVP. I know it's a regular season award, but I'm just making the case. And now we have the Magic versus the Warriors in the finals. The payout for this would be insane. We're trying to stay alive down 3-2. Terrence Ross for three. He gets fouled. Oh, I thought he made it. Derrick Rose gives it to Curry. Curry trying to drive to the basket, getting double team, kicks it out. Derrick Rose for three. Misses it, rebound Ross, and there will be a game seven. Luca played 18 minutes and fouled out. And this man, Luca, just won an NBA championship with the Magic. This is the most 2K thing to ever happen. Well, we're officially halfway through, and Luca's won two MVPs in five rings in 15 years. That's pretty bad. And we're back to reality. They're the second seed. They gotta play New Orleans, and we're gonna blow out them in game seven here. Luca with 55, 11, and seven. Why can't you do this on any other team except for the Magic? Now we gotta play the Warriors. All right, well, I definitely should have hopped into that one. I thought the game was over and the Mavs were going to force a game seven, but they didn't. It was a tie game. Wiggins missed the jumper. Finney Smith just fouls and Curry makes a free throw to win the game. Luka can't beat the Warriors with his own team, but can beat him with the Magic. Got it. And we're right back on schedule. How is Luka, Katie, and Kyrie not a first seed? Oh, sorry. And Ben Simmons. I forgot about Ben. We got the Raptors in the first round and we're just barely going to get by the Raptors here in game six. Now we got to play the Bulls and that's going to be a nice gentleman sweep. How about that? You think Luka, Kyrie, Katie, and Simmons can make the final? I don't know. Looks like we found that answer pretty quickly. That'll be a sweep. And we got to play the Clippers in the finals. And that right there is going to be another sweep. Nice little championship, buddy. Glad you could win it with KD and Kyrie, man. This would be a nasty duo in real life, man. Let's see what happens. Just his 30th MVP in a row. Nuggets got the second seed. And this might be the first time a player outperformed him in every category. Wow, that's crazy. We're going to get by the Suns in six. Now we got to play Dame. Got ourselves a nice gentleman sweep. And we got to play John in the conference finals. How do we go to six with Phoenix and then just... Uh, all right, bro. And we got to play Philly in the finals. Let's see it. Wow. Wow, this team just steamrolled everyone outside of Phoenix and Jokic being the better player on the team. Got a terrible team here. Let's see what happens. I think I'm more shocked he made Indiana relevant. Like they're the first seed. 
That's insane. This man made a tanking franchise relevant. Well, not relevant enough. They're going to be out in the first round. Luka jumping a cool 39, 10, and 11 in the playoffs. Just not enough. Now we got Luka with the Algo team. A 22-point MVP is very low tier for Luka, but he got it. And we're the one seed we got Denver in the first round. And that's going to go ahead and be a sweep. Got to play John ja Memphis. I don't think this team is going to lose a playoff game. Maybe it will get a game. We'll see. Well, they took three games, but we took four. So we're going to the finals. And the two Algo teams going up against each other. This is perfect. Oh, yeah. We're just going to get gentlemen swept. That's awesome. Another bad team, but they got some good young players. Got Embiid's 20th MVP. And Luka making the Pistons relevant third seed. I mean, he had a good year. I guess he just didn't put up Embiid numbers. Got a close one here. Jimmy driving to the basket. Step back. Doesn't do anything. Pump fake. Give it to Tyler. Turns the ball over. Bogdanovich driving. Lay up. And it's good. Four-point lead. Lowry trying to drive, kicking at the BAM. Okay, I don't know what's going on here. Tyler for three. Misses it. Rebounds to Deke, and we're going to the second round. Luka with 29 and 15. Not bad. Back to Pat Will and the Bulls. And they're going to cook us right here. Wow, I did not think we'd get swept by them. DeRozan is going insane in the playoffs, shooting 60% from three. Now we're up in Toronto with Luka Siakam and a Twitch streamer. We got Jokic winning MVP, and the Raptors as the second seed. Luka definitely had a better year than Jokic. I don't know how he didn't win it. Well, never mind. They're just going to get swept here by Miami. That's cool. Another bad team. We'll see how he does with Jalen Green. And Bead back to winning it. And we're fighting in the playing tournament. Won the first game. Oh, no, we didn't. No, we didn't. <laughs> no, he didn't. Just to be fair here, I'm not watching a Rockets Nuggets play in tournament game. Luka had himself a nice season. On to the next team. Let's see how he does with Pop and the Spurs. And Luka's just going to keep letting Embiid win it. How does he keep making these terrible teams relevant? Man, he put up 31, 9, and 11 and didn't win MVP and making the Spurs team good. That's crazy. And we're going to lose to the Warriors in the first round. Luka did his best drop in 37, 11, and 11 in the playoffs, but I guess that's not enough. Now we got the Suns where Chris Paul is going to win sixth man of the year. Embiid winning it again. At least I was right about the sixth man. And shocker there, Suns are the one seed. If these aren't MVP numbers, then I don't know what are, man. Gonna take down the Clippers here in game six. We've played the Grizzlies so many times this video. And they're gonna beat us here in six games. Luka with a triple-double here, but it didn't matter. Ja did his thing, too. Not a bad team on 2K, but I mean, you know, we'll see what Luka can do. This man in beat is insane. And Luka's more insane for making the Thunder the fourth seed. I guess these numbers don't beat out in B, but still, man. And Memphis is just gonna trash us again. That's crazy. These are pretty underwhelming numbers for Luka in the playoffs. Now we're on the Timberwolves with Gobert. Let's see what happens. I'm actually tired of seeing this now. They got the first seed versus the Blazers. And these are good numbers, but if Luka can't drop over 30-something again, but again, we saw him drop 22 points and win it, so I don't know what deserves MVP. Gonna come out here with a gentleman sweep here in the first round. We got Denver in the second. Another gentleman sweep here. Okay. Now, can we beat Memphis for the first time in 10 years? And we finally do. Took him down in six games. Nice voice crack. This video went from a Luka experiment to just Luka versus Embiid. And the Sixers got the gentleman sweep on us. and Embiid with 34, 18, and 6. Like, how are you supposed to stop this man? Like, what, like, what can he do? I actually like this team to be a fifth or sixth seed when the year started, so I'm glad they're doing well. Alright, Embiid, we get it. You won the video, bro. And for the second time, Luka didn't make first team. He's on second team. And wow, they're the sixth seed. I guess that's what I said. But <laughs> but I meant without Luka. This is not a good year from Luka. Yeah, this is rough. We're going to take down the Wolves in six. Now we got the Algo. We're going to take them down in six. And then we have Patrick Beverly and the Lakers. Just got to hold on here and we're going to the finals. Oh my, oh my God, what a dot. That might end the game. Bet for three. Come on, let's get him. Oh my God, that was bad. They're the worst shooting team in the league for a reason. And now we have the Heat and Blazers in the finals. That's a pretty weird one. And Luka's going to get himself his eighth championship in this video. We have such high expectations for Luka that this is an underwhelming stat line for finals MVP. We got two teams left. Here's the Warriors. I should have kept track of Embiid. I wish I did. How are the Warriors not the one seed? I'm surprised Curry didn't lead the team in scoring. This series somehow went seven games, but okay. Now we got to play the Wolves who just keep getting marketing on their team. And a team with Luka and Curry on, it's going to lose in the second round. For as many times as he's made bad teams good, he's been on good teams that have underperformed. And our last team's the Wizards where Luka can reunite with his best friend Porzingis. This is actually crazy. I'm not sure what I expected to happen in this video, but definitely not this. Luka only won five MVPs. That's crazy. We're going to win in six here versus the Cavs, and then we're going to get swept by Philly here. All right, well, Luka, you won five MVPs and eight rings. Moral of the story, they got some secret sauce down in Dallas. Goodbye.